Hey everyone, welcome to the Horror Show. I'm Cecil Laird. I'm in Fuego here. Marcia Becker. And we're here to start what's going to be a small run of trailers coming straight out of San Diego Comic Con 2016. These are probably going to take up most of next week, so bear with us while we get through these. But everyone's excited to take a look at it and uh, see what we can see. Now what we're doing first is the Comic Con trailer for the Fox series of a film turned TV show, which is The Exorcist. Yeah. Got and Gina it Davis is in there. Gina Davis. Yeah. Yep. It's widely renowned as most people's favorite or the most scary horror movie of all time. Ever. No. So I don't know how a TV Debatable. show is going to be able to. No, I never thought that, but that's what a lot of people say. It's it's always on lists that as the, yeah. as the scariest movie of all time. So. Picking up green slime or. Soup or pea soup, that yep, was, exactly. Uh, I don't know. I, I think maybe we uh, should reserve judgment until we watch it. So let's do indeed. this, okay? Yeah, the first one looked decent. Here we go it's in easy. three, two, one. Father Marcus, what do you want? I was told you were an exorcist. Who is that key's holding up? Does it matter? Yeah, I think it does. I am not a crazy person. No, I'm, I'm not saying you're crazy. I'm... There is something inside my house. It's a demon. Angela, demons aren't real. They are metaphors. It's trying to take my daughter. You're being manipulated by forces you can't even begin to understand. Father Tomas, the rising star. I think God spoke to me today. What did he say? He said, I want you to help his family. Anybody up there? You're afraid? Yeah, you should be too. Look up on me, Marcus. I'm intrigued, but you set the benchmark really high for your show when you have a statement like that early on about how it's the most terrifying film of all time. It's like, man, you got big shoes to fill if you're going to immediately remind the audiences of that. So, I don't know. It yeah. doesn't look bad, though. It doesn't look terrible. No. It looks like they're trying to update some stuff. It. Mm -hmm. I, I like these early shots. They look good. I'm not sure how many episodes it's supposed to be, but I don't know if it's if it'll sustain like a full ten or thirteen episode season. Like I think eight might yeah. be its its perfect it's, amount or something. But I don't know. Who knows? Yeah. Being this, a network show, I doubt it. Yeah, I mean yeah. the actors look pretty good, especially mm. the more intense of the two. He looks pretty good, but. Mm. I don't know, man. Uh, we didn't get to see too many demon things. We saw a lot of digital effects on the little girl, but the only demon we saw was sort of that little boy yeah. with the that, weird that teeth. That was kind of scary. The golem I, I like teeth. That. <laughs> Big time. Doesn't it look like My Gina gracious. Davis yeah. is like weird? Well, she's getting old. Right. Yeah, she's getting older, man. She's broadening out a little bit. Yeah. She's I was really shocked that, at that, that statement, big face. though. The moment we just went past where he's like, Demons are not real. They're a metaphor. I honestly don't know of any priest that would ever say something like that. But maybe sense. that's For like modern. No, 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 kinda... no, no. I disagree with that. I, I am? I, and in Coming fact, from a heavy religious background, I, I can't I disagree. know. I, no, I think if there's, I think priests nowadays would definitely think that. I mean, younger priests just sort of coming up. He's literally supposed mentality. to be just out of training. Uh -huh. So he, you know, just he probably just is, a... is like a new age, mm -hmm. you know, like. No, listen, there are no actual demon demons. It's all metaphor, you know? It's Wait, is he an exorcist, just, or is he just a priest? He's a priest that's training to be an exorcist. So why would he? Why would some priest 
training to be an exorcist believe Exude that because he's yeah. being forced to be trained to be he's like called uh, upon just, to but be my the whole trainee. point is if you didn't believe that they were actually demons then why would you become an exorcist or why would you even believe god is real <laughs> <laughs> i don't know I, I just the, the yang, man. <laughs> I, you know i don't want to give it a hard time or anything but it I just do. <laughs> doesn't feel i don't feel like I want to watch it from watching that trailer. Like I might watch it just to see what happens, but I feel like I would be bored. I was pretty bored watching the trailer and and watching the Exorcist. It was a great movie. I don't really and after watching Outcast, I can't. Yeah, I, can't. I was I was honestly we just got done watching Outcast. Yeah. Sorry, right right before this, and, uh, and maybe that's, that's a show that has wowed us yeah. collectively. I'm wondering if maybe something like that caused them to want to do something like this, but well, no, no. it would have had no. to be in production well before the show aired. Oh, okay, but you know, nonetheless, the, it's in vogue right now. Obviously. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Serialized horror television is mm-hmm. is where it's at right now. But Good you news know, for us. Yeah, well, maybe we shouldn't be that judgmental because people swear by Hannibal and. And that was a property that was nobody thought could be matched property. or even, you know, exceeded in quality on television, no less network television. That was yeah. better than any of the movies in my yeah. opinion, including the Silence of the way. Lambs. Yeah. yeah. So who knows? This could be good. I mean, you know, I'm going to definitely try at least the no. pilot, and I'll, knowing me, I'll get roped into watching the rest of it because I'm so into sort of the demony mm-hmm. kind of aspect of horror. Oh, yeah. I like that a lot. The verdict's still out. Yeah, I guess. exactly. No. So, I don't know. I think that pretty much covers our reaction mm-hmm. to the Comic-Con trailer for The Exorcist coming this fall on Fox. Yes, <laughs> this September, guys. <laughs> so, thanks very much for watching. I've been Cecil Laird. I'm Ian Fuego here. Marsh Parker. And until next time, remember, stay, stay scared. scared.